a company by the name of Troflem has come up with a robot dog which looks like uh, the one from Boston Dynamics but this one has a flame thrower on its back so the plan is to sell this robots and they're calling it a thermometer more like a terminator so you get the point but this robot is capable of uh, being able to throw, throw being able to throw out streams of fire for to up to 30 feet and it can do this for 45 minutes of course this makes you wonder where will you be able to use this type of robot is it more like uh, in war or will it be used in more like let's say in Far Cry 7 where you can be able to use it in, with a flamethrower you know get the point but they planning to sell it and so far they say that the, it was used in a series called Yellowstone and in so it has been used in a South Park episode called Pandemic Special so maybe it can be used in films but and maybe for fun i don't know who will be able to buy this type of robot but it looks amazing it brings us back to that tutorial of a guy who was teaching how to be able to disable a dog robot i don't know if you remember but we did upload it we'll be able to leave a link here so that you can be able to see it the guy was explaining some very important steps on how you can be able to disable a robot dog. The limb articulators are located at the top of the four limbs. I would recommend 62 grain green tip penetrators because they will be armor plated. If you don't have access to that, paintball will be effective in disabling the cameras. However, it's easily reversible. Another option will be to do a mix, 50-50 mix of old engine oil, oil based paint black, and a good dose of sand into a balloon. The sand will scratch up and work, gum up the works, uh, and the paint will be very difficult to remove. So, and as we go forward, it looks like uh, most robot dogs will be the first generation of robots in the in the army might be robot dogs. I mean, from we have seen drones being used, and maybe the second is going to be robot dogs. And as we go further to a point where we will get humanoids which have the capability of uh, being you know the mobility in terms of mobility and agility like they can be able to handle different tasks better than say robot dogs but as of now robot dogs are more advanced in terms of uh, mobility and many more things compared to humanoids so it makes sense for robot dogs to be to start you know being adopted into the army so you need to have those tricks so now you can be able to disable one say they deploy it to you yeah yeah, yeah. so in the meantime see you in the next one let's end this one here as we end it with a thermometer you are a thermometer go buy yourself a thermometer they say that it will be out in the third quarter of this year and you can be able to buy it if you want one see you in the next one don't forget to buy one